my favorite part is doing the little swirls, the little swirly swirls. What do you know? She's back in the car. Another freaking core vlog. Oh my god. Listen, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know. I'm about to get hardcore judged because I had full intention for today's video and it still will be wrapping Christmas gifts because like I'm just in that mood. I want to get started on my wrappings. I have a lot to wrap this year. And then I realized I don't have tape, ribbons, or gift tags. And I'm like, oh, I'm gonna need that. <laughs> so um, thankfully hopped on the old Target app and placed a pickup order. And he also did need his beard softener from Target, from Bevel. So I'm like, all right, well, make the most of it, I suppose. I'm sorry, but if you're not utilizing the Target pickup drive up feature, it's just the best. Like if you don't feel like going in the store, because God knows when I end up going into Target, I leave with stuff I don't need. <laughs> so I just love being able to do a pickup order and go and pick it up and it's quick, it's easy breezy. So I am getting a little bit of a later start on the vlog today, it's already 3 p.m. All I've done today is work out and shower and edit um, a video that went up last night when you are watching this vlog. Um, my sweet darling husband, Yarmin, <laughs> he filmed a male gift guide because we've been getting so many requests for that this year and I was like, okay, do you wanna like do it together? Do you wanna like let me know and I'll film it? And he's like, I can film it. And I'm like, oh my God, that's so sweet. So he ended up doing it all by himself and he did such a good job, but um, he filmed it before he logged into work and then I spent the morning editing it and like, it's like over 30 minutes. <laughs> so the editing took me like a couple hours. So it's just been like a lot of random work stuff and editing this morning. Oh, I forgot to put my Apple watch back on. Oh, it feels so naked. So sorry we're starting a little late on the vlog. It just had stuff to do. Honestly, people who don't let you merge are the worst. West. So we're gonna do our Target pickup order, then we're gonna go home, and I thought we could have a cozy afternoon and wrap some gifts together. I usually like to watch um, <laughs> The Office Christmas episodes or Glee Christmas episodes. It's like a little tradition I have. Um, last night we watched Medea Christmas. I'm like just plowing through the Christmas movies I had on my uh, recordings. <laughs> so let me know if there's any that like you require that you love and like you need to watch every year because I need to know if I've watched it so let me know your favorite must watch Christmas movie below I won't be watching anything today when we hang out and wrap but it will still be a cozy good time I don't know if I'll even film the whole time I wrap because it's gonna take me like a very very long time but grab your presents grab your wrapping paper grab a snack whatever and we are gonna get cozy as we wrap some gifts all right here we are I, oh my gosh, I just um, brought everything downstairs from my office and I've like, been like accumulating all these Christmas gifts and in Capricorn nature, I have a <laughs> list on my phone. I've been like kind of keeping track of like what I wanted to get people, what I already bought and all that. Oh, I'm wearing my happy llama days shirt from Mud Cloth. So, you know, I have all of them with like check marks, but now I need to make sure, like I'm gonna check off again, which ones have come in. So I make sure like nothing hasn't not come in by Christmas. Let's do this. Let's rock and roll. If you are a family member or a friend, I kindly ask you to bounce. So if you guys remember, this is the Christmas wrapping paper. I got from Walmart a long time ago now. I feel like that was forever ago, back when I bought the pink tree. This month is going by way too fast, way too fast. Cause like, I don't know, I'm just, this is one of my favorite Vlogmases. And it's kind of crazy. Cause like, of course, this is like the worst year, but I'm having a really good time. And I feel like, I don't know. I just feel like you guys are here with me every day and like, we're truly a family and we hang out every day and 
I just love it. Like, I love this. And it's going to be really weird when it's over, but I am going through um, all the way till the end of December. So I know some people stop after Christmas. This is good wrapping paper. I'm sorry, but like, I was sleeping on Walmart's wrapping paper. Because I, I usually get it from Target, but like, so pricey and you don't get enough. So I'm sorry, I'm like low key, not a good rapper. And you'd think I would be because I'm a Capricorn, but like, whoop. I don't know how people normally do this. Okay, wait, oh, I lost it. <laughs> it's always so satisfying when people are able to do the shnash. Um, <laughs> anyway. Mimi, I love you and I love that you watch Vlogmas, but I hope you're not still here. Because I'm about to wrap your gift first. Like I said, I should be good at this. The issue with me is I'm impatient. I've rushed things. So this is the gift I got for my grandma. I'm not gonna show all these gifts, but like just some fun ideas. Cause I had mentioned a customized puzzle. My grandparents love doing puzzles. I feel like they pretty much always have one out on their dining table that they're always working on, especially in the winter. So I was like, okay, a custom puzzle seems like a great idea. Oh, that like just fits. Oh, miracles. I also did pull up like the Christmas tag. So like I can answer some fun Christmassy questions for you guys. This is like the glossy tape. I like the matte tape which is so stupid but like there's something about like the matte tape where it's like you touch it it's just like smooth i didn't realize i bought the glossy tape am i silly or do you guys also feel that way or maybe you prefer the satin tape anyway when it comes to like the edges i feel like they're never like smooth like my gifts don't look terrible but they don't look like stunning like she's not the worst She's like cute enough, but like if you get up close, it's a little messy. All right, let me see in my Target bag tricks here. All right, I'm pretty, I feel like I buy these every year. These look exactly the same as last year. Um, these Wonder Shop gold and silver gift tags, like they look exactly the same. All right, just collectively starting a trash pile. I need a pen. And I also got some ribbon for if I'm feeling fancy. Where do you guys put your stickers on your gift? <laughs> do you put it in the corner? Do you put it in the middle? Am I the only one who thinks about this? <laughs> to Mimi from Allie T. If you guys didn't know, my family calls me Allie T. Okay, next. This, <laughs> this gift. Let me just confirm that this is the gift I'm thinking of. Yep, okay. This is my favorite gift of the year that I bought for my husband. So, stay tuned for the Christmas vlog. Oh, this should fit perfectly. Oh, maybe not. Maybe this way? Why did I feel like this was gonna fit so well? I'm gonna do it this way. I'm gonna do it this way, but anyway, it's a fun gift. We'll see how he feels about it. All right, let me let me pull up these questions. There's so many different kinds of these things. This one's from YouTubeSociety.com. Just Googled it. Question number one: How do you celebrate Christmas? That's a broad statement, a broad question. Um, you guys see how I celebrate Christmas every single day. Honestly, like real talk, my favorite part of celebrating Christmas is Vlogmas. It like, it's like the biggest, cause I'm a big tradition gal. It's like the biggest tradition in my adult life that just, I know it's Christmas time. Like it's not Christmas without Vlogmas, you know what I mean? Oh, this one is a little messy. Question number two, how are you spending this Christmas? Um, ah. multitask and distress um <laughs> yes kind of okay um this year i am doing the usual 
we have a very small local family on my side um, and we're just gonna chill with them nothing crazy like the, the usual Christmas is pretty like chill for us we'll have a little Christmas Eve party at my house and then Christmas Day we go to my grandma's um, my whole family like has decided to just we've been only seeing each other throughout this time to like stay safe and only see you know close family so we're just able to do like a pretty normal Christmas because of that you know there's no traveling there's not a lot of people all right gift number two is wrapped question number three are you good at buying gifts for others now I don't mean to toot my own horn but I've been told that I give pretty good gifts that's what I've been told I'm not trying to brag let's see if we can do it again with what people like and things they have their eye on like a few months before Christmas or a year before Christmas. <laughs> like I'm always taking notes. I honestly feel like Yarman's pretty easy because he has like so many interests, you know? Like he's, you know, a tech lover and he loves athletic wear and he likes gadgets. This one if I'm gonna fit. Okay, maybe I'm like actually the worst rapper. <laughs> Because this is what happens, I normally end up using way too much wrapping paper. But now I'm getting a little too conservative and nothing will fit. Here we are. All right, number four. What is your most memorable Christmas memory? And I feel like, I don't know why this is the first thing that came to my mind, so I feel like that's like legitimate. My mom gave me the best childhood. You know, like she was a single mom. She struggled financially. You know, she worked three jobs just to make me feel like our life was stable and normal. And like, I would have never known that we struggled until I was older. And like, I just am so appreciative of her giving me so much, like trying so hard. Like she's just a true champ, like a true strong single mother. Like it's amazing to look back on. I'm like, wow, this woman was insanely good to me. I remember, I was obsessed with the Spice Girls. I remember on Christmas morning one day, the biggest moment that came to me was when I walked around the corner and there was a Spice Girls bicycle with like a bow on it. And I was just like, oh my God, amazing. <laughs> if there's any kiddos watching, fast forward a minute. sister anyone so my mom did such an amazing job with s-a-n-t-a <laughs> why am i so nervous there's a kid here because so not only would you know we put out the cookies they bite the cookies and she won the carrots for the reindeer my mom this is like a tip i don't know i don't know if this is like a thing this is probably a thing people do but she would take like men's boots and like put powder on the bottom of them and like put like step prints on the rug so it looked like he had like walked through the house. Oh my God, like my, oh my God, my heart is so full just thinking about that Christmas joy you feel as a child. Like when you come downstairs and like that magic of like, holy crap, he was here. And I just cannot wait to have that again with our future kids. I just can't wait for that like, oh my God. Christmas magic, you know? So that's my Christmas memory. How did you spend last Christmas? Pretty much the same as this Christmas in terms of like plans, just with less face masks. <laughs> this one did not come out amazing. Sorry, mom. I'm gonna put some ribbon on this one to make up for it. This is not a lot of ribbon. Oh man, I definitely didn't buy enough ribbon. Maybe. I guess you don't really use a ton of ribbon. All right. Let's see if I still got it. All right. So cross it around. Bring it around town. And then you do this and this. Comment a pineapple emoji if you got the reference. Okay. We did it. 
We got the bow secured. I'm gonna just tape it because I don't, I don't trust it. Let me know what you guys are doing for Christmas this year. If you're doing anything or you're just staying home. I feel bad for people whose family are far away and they can't see them or they just don't feel safe. Spend Christmas with me. There'll be a vlog. We'll hang out. I got you. Now is the fun part. My favorite part is doing the little swirls, the little swirly swirls. Let's try that again. Oh, we're getting there. Ooh, it's so satisfying. It's just so much fun. Ah! The sound. much fun and it, like it just makes presents more fun all right what's the next question on Christmas Eve what do you leave out for Santa um, when I was a kid we would just do cookies and milk and carrots for the reindeer we never did like that I don't think we ever did me and my mom not that I remember the you know like that reindeer food people would sprinkle on the lawn. Yes. Oh, crap. Hi, my camera overheated. Don't know how long I was recording before I noticed. <laughs> so I knocked out a few more presents while the camera was cooling down. Um, what is your favorite Christmas movie? Uh, I feel like I've answered this way too many times. It's Charlie Brown Christmas. It just, it's nostalgic for me. It's a family movie that we watch every year. All right, what is your favorite Christmas song? I feel like for me, it's a toss up between Last Christmas and Baby Please Come Home. I need to get this big one out of the way. I tried to like keep uh, the boxes of stuff this year to make wrapping easier because literally every year I get like too excited and then I end up just like taking the gift out of the package and throwing the package away or recycling it. And then I have like these awkward gift shapes. <laughs> and I just, I feel like unwrapping a present is so much more fun than like a gift bag. I know some presents like need a gift bag, but I prefer to like wrap what I can. What do you eat on Christmas day? On Christmas day, my grandma usually cooks ham and like mashed potato rolls, green beans. It's like kind of Thanksgiving-y, but like without turkey stuffing or cranberry sauce. So never mind. Do you have any Christmas Eve traditions? Yes. And I apologize because I feel like I say this all the time, but my birthday's on Christmas Eve. And it's my favorite, favorite day of the year. So my whole life we have been having like a big Christmas Eve party. Well, it's not big again, my family is small, but like we have a Christmas Eve get together and we do like appetizer day. We all bring an appetizer uh, and like, it's just like a fun spread. Like it's not like a normal dinner. It's just like an appetizer. We do like um, a Yankee swap or some people call it a white elephant, I think. But uh, it's really just like a fun, festive day. I like to dress up because it's my birthday. And yeah, it's a good time. And it's always been nice because like I always have like something fun coming on my birthday. So I'm a big routine tradition person. <laughs> Um, do you wear Christmas jumpers? If so, show us a picture. I only wear Christmas everything. <laughs> um, show us your Christmas decorations. You guys have already seen them. Do you like eggnog? Yes, but in small quantities. Have you ever visited the North Pole? I wish. What was your favorite gift you've ever received on Christmas? I mean, that Spice Girls vibe though. Wrapping honestly just sucks. <laughs> like, I like the idea of wrapping. I'm like, ooh, cozy, let's wrap Christmas presents. And then like 20 minutes in, my back hurts. There's trash everywhere. <laughs> just kidding, kind of. All right, next question. Have you ever gone Christmas caroling? I don't think I have. I think that was just like kind of before my time. Unless you guys have been and you're my age. Um, I wish. I think that sounds like so cozy and fun. 
I'm here for all the old school Christmas traditions, you know? Hashtag bring back Carolyn 2021, because this year is... Have you ever built a gingerbread house? Yes. Try to name all of Santa's reindeer. Oh my gosh. Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, and Rudolph. Did I already say Rudolph? Finish this elf quote. The best way to spread Christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear. What's the worst present you ever received? Ooh. I can't just roast them like that. What is your all time favorite Christmas food? Hmm. So typically on Christmas day, my grandma would put out like this cheese ball. You guys know I love cheese. And it's like served with crackers. It's like that cheese ball that's like rolled with nuts, I think. And it's just so freaking good. I love like a cheese and cracker vibe, but that one always has just reminded me of the holidays. It's funny because like I'm looking at the pile that I've wrapped versus the pile I have left. And I feel like I've made progress, but then I'm like, haven't. All right, I feel like this is getting really long, so I think we might need to switch over to a time lapse because my battery is gonna die on my camera. So let's do a little time lapse of some more. Okay, I just finished wrapping and my bestie sent me my Christmas gifts from Pennsylvania. Um, I feel bad, her last one hasn't come in yet and I want it to get to her by Christmas, but I don't. <sighs> that last item is like the best item. <laughs> Let's open up Lily's Christmas gift together. There's two boxes. I'm intrigued by like this like long skinny box. Ooh, what is this? Bloom Bar Floral Designs. Oh, pompous grass. Thanks, boo. I love these. I love these so much. They're like smaller than the ones I have now. Oh, so freaking pretty. These are so pretty. Oh my God. Love, I need to be gentle. I love those. Thank you, boo. Okay, let's open package number two. All right, here we go. I got a little card. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, this freaking card. I don't know if I should show this. Oh my god. I only need one battery powered device in bed and it ain't a Kindle. <laughs> it's an inside joke. I love that. Sending you good vibrations on your birthday. <laughs> All right, let me read what she said. When I saw this card, LOL, I knew I had to get it for you. It's us to a T. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna cry. I just miss her so much, but we FaceTime like once a week. We talk a lot still. Love you, boo. I love you so much. I miss you. And like, I can't wait till things are a little bit safer so we can like go visit them in Pennsylvania or vice versa. Um, Cause originally we wanted to visit them sometime in December, um, but it just doesn't feel safe. So um, very sweet of her to send me some gifts in the mail. Oh my gosh, yes! A face for my pompous. Oh. Love. I'm just gonna like cut the bottom. That's gonna look so stinking cute. Ooh, and we have a candle. It's called Warm and Cozy. Mmm, that smells so good. It smells like Christmas trees and oranges. And it's hand poured small batches with soy wax from Sweet Water Decor. Love that. I'm so glad these didn't break in the mail. She used packing peanuts. So smart. Oh my God, I love this so much. Our first Christmas as Mr. and Mrs. Rodriguez. 
I can't even take it. And it's so my vibe with the white and gold. Lily, I love you so much. If you're watching this, I'm going to send you a video right now or FaceTime you. I'm going to tear up. I got to go. All right, guys, just hopping on to wrap up this vlog. It's 8 o'clock. I am editing now. Can upload it for the morning. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Good night. Thank you.